Hello there. My name's Paul Byrne and I'm the Managing Director of a company called PLS. We're in a, we were an early stage technology company in the supply chain asset tracking space. Um, we developed a unique proposition that we were taking to market and we were on the brink of winning several large contracts. Uh, we were a small team, um, small and agile, and it worked in terms of the process of developing our product, engaging with our initial customers, and taking uh, the product to market to the point of deployment. Uh, following that, um, when we got to a point where we'd have to physically deploy these solutions and we have to engage with multiple projects in parallel, we had some very different challenges. Uh, we, need to, we needed to scale at speed, uh, whilst maintaining the quality uh, to which we'd been started to become recognized for, and also the agility that enabled us to keep ahead uh, of a very fast moving market. I'll talk um, a little bit about our business and what it does. We, we are a uh, provider of technology solutions in the supply chain asset tracking space. More specifically, what we do is we help retailers and manufacturers gain better control of their returnable packaging assets. Uh, what are they? They are things like metal roll cages, uh, plastic pallets, um, plastic boxes, etc., that typically are used to transport primary products throughout a supply chain. Our analysis had identified that retailers and manufacturers have significant quantifiable problems with the control of management and these assets. And technology typically hasn't been deployed as it has been in other areas of the supply chain um, to drive the visibility that can then give you control and performance. So specifically, um, what is it that we do? It's a combination of supply chain consultancy, expertise in sensor technology, typically RFID and barcode, which is a very quickly uh, evolving space. And it's the uh, deployment of our bespoke uh, software platform that takes data um, from, um, from the sensor technology and presents it back to the customer in terms of usable insight. Uh, and why would you bother doing all of this? The problems that our customers have in this area are very quantifiable. Um, they lose these assets, they have too many of them, they're not available when and where they need them to support production or picking product into store. And by giving them visibility uh, of these assets across their supply chain, they can deliver some very immediate and very significant benefits. So typically our solution will deliver a very quick ROI uh, and will pay back within, within a six month period. So we engage Nina to, to help us uh, manage our way through some of these challenges. And this, um, it was clear from the outset that this was a combination of, of process, of technology, and of change management. And this is where Nina's broad experience and skill set was very clearly able to help us along the journey um, to get us to, to what was a very positive outcome. We were able to focus um, on the areas in which the business needed most help in the earliest phase. And this was actually um, our sales engagement. Our ability to take a product to market um, as quickly as we can, as broadly as we can, as efficiently as we can, um, in what is a very fast moving marketplace where the competition is after us is absolutely paramount. So we were able to build an approach that enabled us to deliver um, a very bespoke uh, solution proposal to a new customer within four weeks of an initial engagement. Uh, a phenomenal improvement on where we'd been before. Um, whilst doing that, we were also able to maintain a focus on the bigger prize which is understanding how this combination of process change and technology could help us to improve our business as we continue to grow. Specifically, Nina worked with us to, to introduce the idea and then to select, uh, deploy, um, and make sure um, everything was working um, with a, a piece of technology called Autodesk Fusion Lifecycle. Which is, a, uh, which is a fantastic um, piece of software that enables us to, to map and automate our end-to-end -end business processes. Um, it's infinitely flexible, and that is key to its, uh, to its attraction, but also one of the big challenges, because not only has the technology itself got to work, uh, the team has got to be engaged, and the processes within the business have got to support it. So we have recently gone live with our first uh, version uh, a fusion lifecycle to support our sales engagement process um, and it's working exceptionally well. 